What's up, y'all? Y'all get a lot of videos from me today. So, um, I just wanted to let you know what's going on. Well, I was talking about in my weekly that you should launch things uh, at this time and not a little later. I have a new launch coming up. So, it's not that different. I've been doing a podcast for a little while. But one of the things that you may or may not know about me uh, from the content that I post here is that I'm sad like all the time i just like i'm <laughs> having a rough time with it and like i and, and i'm big sad about things and i try not to make that your problem um and I, the only reason that i'm really bringing it up now is because it has gotten in the way of my productivity i'm just not getting shit done the way that i had hoped i was going to get shit done last year and so what this tells and it <laughs> we're at a point now in the timeline where uh, not being so sad doesn't really seem like an option for me. And so what needs to happen is the barrier to getting shit done needs to come down a little bit. And so um, last year I was running this podcast. It was called What is the Time? It was an interview style podcast. I was like interviewing my friends and uh, teachers that I had had and this kind of thing and trying to get some information about how to navigate the world that we live in. Um, it was just difficult to do. It was difficult to run those interviews. It was difficult to get scheduling done. It was difficult to, like, I was just running into all these obstacles and, uh, and I was too sad to, like, deal with all that shit. So, in order to bring the barrier down, a couple of things needed to happen. One is um, I've been working really hard on captions and subtitles and uh, just, like, making sure that all of that is working together properly. Um, I can't put in that much effort anymore. I will just use the automatic ones. The automatic ones sort of suck. Uh, my name is Zamboni. They, uh, the robots sometimes call me Sambo, which is the name of a famous slave from folk folklore. The first time that happened, I was like, fuck this forever. I'm not doing this. I, and now, and so I just put it onto my shoulder. And so I gave it uh, a lot of time and effort. Now, I think I just have to let the robots do what the robots are going to do. Pluto's in Aquarius, you know, what are we going to do? <laughs> like, if they think I'm a slave, so be it. I kind of am a slave to these robots, right? So, um, they, so I, so look forward to, uh, subtitles that are kind of whack in the long, in the, especially in the longer form content. Cause it takes like two or three times the amount of the time that the video is. So if the video is an hour and a half long or something like that, then it's going to be like four and a half hours of like editing the captions and stuff like that. I just don't have that kind of time anymore. So, um, so the captions are not going to be there. And also I'm going to do less of the like interview style of different people and trying to get people on the show and trying and sending out cold emails and all this kind of thing. Um, my, my little heart can't take all that, but good news is my homie, delicious Brian Wilkins, DB is going to be uh, coming through for regular appearances for um, a segment that we're going to call What If Magic Were Real? So we're just going to talk about some shit um, as if magic were real. We're going to talk about problems that we've been trying to solve or like uh, things that we've been thinking or studying. And most of the time, so like, for, for example, recently I've been reading about uh, economics. And so I've like read an, an uh, economics textbook and uh, economists don't think that magic is real. I, however, do think that magic is real. I also think that the economics principles that they mentioned in that book were real. So my job is to put them together and see what the world looks like if both economics and magic were real. My man DB is really good at this kind of thing. And so he and I are going to spend some hours shooting this shit, you know, like it's a, so again, not going to be super academic. I'm not going in with like questions loaded up already and things that I want to talk about and I want to pull things out of the guest and all this. It's going to be a couple of dudes shooting the shit, seeing what we can come up with, trying to laugh a little bit, watch if you feel like it, don't watch if you don't feel like it i'm down for whatever but uh the hope is that we will all have a little bit of fun here and uh that includes you so here it comes now and uh if you are on patreon and you saw my electional report then you will know exactly why i decided to release that today anyway see you soon